Guys, today we're gonna to be doing something completely different. I actually won something from the outdoor store off Instagram. We're gonna be doing an unboxing. And El Charo was sent to me for free. Let's check it out. It says that side up, but I mean, this works too, I guess. Packaging, check. So in one side of it, we have the main body, it looks like. Some instructions, uh, main body, cord. This thing. Skewers and uh, the power cord and speed adjuster. Let's take a look at what's in the other side. So they came with a clamshell of foam and one side you saw the main body, the skewers, the power cord, the speed uh, adjuster and a couple of racks to hold the skewers on. But in the other side of the clamshell there's another lid tape to it. So open that up and see. I assume that's our rack uh, to hold our skewers and our skewer handles and all that good stuff. And I assumed right, I didn't make an, a nimrod. Uh, yeah, so inside on this side is our rack and our skewer handles. So I'm gonna get this set to the side and we're gonna get this thing put together, okay? So it looks like these racks, they go on with these pocket screws that uh, they have like a, uh, an Allen head uh, for them. So you can actually ease those out with your fingers while you're getting this assembled. And then uh, we'll look through as we're going through this stuff to see if they have an Allen wrench. If not, I've got plenty and we'll tighten them down uh, with a final tighten with an Allen wrench. So loosen those up with your fingers. This is what it looks like uh, over here. Loosen those up and then you can get these to slide in on both sides. All right, so we've got both sides on here and I was just noticing that there's slots here and it looks like these racks that hold our uh, skewers actually have ears on them and they just kind of slip into place. So we'll get those put on plus the top and bottom bars. They all just slip into place with ears and brackets. Pretty easy. All right, so we got it all assembled that slip right together. And this is a really great design because the way that they uh, counteract each other with the angles, it, it actually holds it together very sturdy. So next thing is I got a handle here uh, and uh, let's grab one of the skewers and we'll get those assembled. All you do is simply see the flat spot, slip it in on the side facing the screw, the screw tightens down on it. Now that comes apart so that you can clean these easier. So you just tighten that screw down so this doesn't spin and your handle is on your skewer. There's six of them. Now we're gonna take you to the back side where uh, our power and uh, speed adjustment cords get plugged in too. Now I'm not gonna undo these ties yet. I'm just gonna snap these together so you can see how simple this product really is. Now your, your, uh, that's the extension cord. Your power actually comes just like this. You can use it with or without your extension. Uh, you can plug it in like that or you can plug it in just like this. It depends on the grill that you have set up. Uh, on this you have an easy uh, speed adjuster and that's going to adjust the speed of the uh, rotisserie uh, spigot running. Inside your instruction manual, 
instructions. There's actually an Allen wrench. So I'm gonna go ahead and get everything tightened down and adjusted. And this thing's already put together. It's literally been less than five minutes. Super easy, very sturdy, very nice design, great. Now all your skewers come uh, with different uh, links adjustable to them because this uh, rack is adjustable. So you just set your skewer in place where you want it and tighten that Allen wrench down so that uh, your length of your skewers is exact for your smoker. So as you can see, it came together pretty quickly. That um, maybe took me seven, eight minutes all together to get it unboxed. Uh, they even give you extra screws in the bag with the instructions that I didn't even use to put this together. So I'm gonna get this wiped down and uh, you know what? I can't wait to put it to work. Guys, thanks for sticking around. Thanks for checking this out. Stick around for videos from the El Charo. We'll be doing some chicken and probably some steaks and good stuff like that. I love you. Brisket Medigal.